Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today is a very special day because today, Christmas Eve, guys, it's Christmas. Uh, unfortunately, we ain't got no snow. Well, unfortunately, I, I don't know. I like snow. I don't like the cold, I like snow, but so unfortunately, we don't have any snow because it's like 50 degrees. But I want to give you guys a quick, brief insight into our lives as far as like Christmas goes and stuff because we are fairly busy and especially me with having to work so um like i said today is christmas eve i worked last night so i got up yesterday afternoon about one o'clock i went to work at seven and i got off at seven this morning uh they tried mandating me to a 16 hour shift which made me work till 11 a.m this morning but i got out of it i slept by the time i got home it was about 7 40 so i slept until 12 and i got up and now it is almost 1 o'clock, so I'm actually running late. I'm supposed to be at my dad's at 1 o'clock. So I slept uh, a, little less, a little less than, f no, probably about four hours. And I'm going to my dad's to start Christmas. And I we're driving separate because I can only stay for so long because I actually have to come back here and get ready to go to work again tonight. I'm working again 7 to 7, so I'll be working. I'll go in at 7 p.m. and I get off at 7 a.m. Christmas morning. So, just a little quick info, so when you guys are sitting around with your family over Christmas, you guys won't see this until after Christmas, but um, next time you're sitting around with your family over the holidays, think about your first responders, right? Uh, think about people in law enforcement, think about people in the fire department, think about people, EMTs, nurses, doctors, that get called in. Think about those people for a minute, and be happy you got these people that you can actually come and rely on and they're always going to be there for you because while you guys are at home enjoying your family we don't get to all right but that's enough about that like i said it's 12 54 i'm supposed to be at my dad's at one it's gonna take me about 40 minutes so we are running late we gotta get going Yeah. Karma! That came from Papa, Grandma, and Jordan. 
What the heck? Take that pick away from me. Um, <laughs> what? I'm going to stay away from you. Um, I'm going to go. It, it does. Okay. Is that real? What are the holding ones? Is that real? What else you nope. got? Oh, yeah. Card. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I got, oh, I'm sorry. I'm excited about those. Okay. Okay, oh, what? Oh, I want it. Oh, 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 you had to have the little kid read to you all. No, no, I was reading it and then he started reading it out loud. I don't know why. I was reading it to myself and then he started reading it. I told Alright guys, so, let's see. Alright guys, quick time check for you guys. It's 318. Uh, so you guys kind of saw a little bit. It's kind of hectic. It's loud. It's crazy in there. So, there's not a whole lot of footage. We've got all the kids and stuff, but... Uh, you saw how busy it is. Like it says, uh, 318. So I got. Technically, I could stay here till about 4. I'm thinking about leaving in probably like 20 minutes or so. And start making my way home so I can get ready for work. Uh, yeah, it's just, it's just kind of a lot of hectic, a lot of crazy. With very, very, very little sleep, is, I'm having issues with energy. But. Uh, I mean, it is what it is. This is the stuff that we deal with. So, you know, everybody's got excuses and why they they're low on energy and stuff. You can't let that stuff hold you down. So, I mean, it is what it is. But uh, I just figured I'd jump in, do a quick time check with you guys, uh, kind of explain why I wasn't filming a whole lot because it was just it was loud and crazy. You guys saw it. But uh, I'm gonna go ahead and sign out here for now, and I'll update you somewhere down the road again. Catch you guys in a little bit. Alright guys, so we worked back to the house. It is 5.35 right now. We stayed at my dad's till about, I don't know, 3.45, 3.50, and then I left. And I got home with about 40 minutes or so to kind of relax and get ready for work. Uh, we do got the presents out. So, we got that done. Um, we've laxed on the tree which should have been right there but we can flat out we kind of just forgot about it um but you know, the, the gifts are what the kids really care about so they are definitely out ready to go when i get home in the morning that's pretty much all the kids are going to be waiting on um Hopefully they don't try to mandate me in the morning. If they do, I'm going to refuse it. Uh, I did my 12-hour shift. There's no reason I should have to stay over because people don't want to show up to work. You know, I got family too, so. That's pretty much it. Uh, like I said, you know, it's about 5.35 right now. I'm going to finish getting my uniform on, my belt, and then head off to work. I got a couple pieces of leftover chicken from dinner at my dad's. And that's about all I got. The you know, place is going to be closing tonight early, so uh, some of them might already be closed. But this is where we're going to leave you off for Christmas Eve. We'll pick it back up Christmas Day, shoot a little bit, because I know when I get home we're going to probably get the kids up and do uh, presents before I go to bed, take a little bit of nap. And then I don't really know what the plans are tomorrow. So, like I said, this is where I'm going to leave you for today. 5.35 Christmas Eve, you guys are probably going to be doing stuff with your family, hanging out, eating dinner, whatever you guys are doing. I'm getting ready to suit up and go to work. So, I'll catch you guys about 7.30ish in the morning. So, they've already opened their gifts. It's Christmas Day morning. Santa brought his gift. That's what he got him, a zoo pass to the zoo. And that's what Troy got. What did you get, Troy? Weather production. Ninjago. 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 Ninj
Uh, he's forgetting about the other thing that I'm looking at right now. I thought he was going to tell you his chair. Oh, yes. Oh, my. Oh, and this. Oh, and, uh, and this is arms. Your, Can you his, spot the mistake? His sister painted him that. Can you spot the mistake? Let us know in the comments if you spot that mistake. Yeah. We got a good laugh out of that this morning. She said she was tired. But that was Autumn's gift to him. Then we got Landon. He's playing with one of his gifts right now. What did you get, Landon? Marble set. Marble set? You got this cool marble race thing Mom just put together for him. That was fun. And what else did you get, Landon? Are you going to show us everything else? We got a Lego set. You got a Lego set, he says? What else? Oh, BD. Oh, pretty much out. Pokemon cards. Oh, BD. So we do. And uh, another gaming chair. Cheetos is wanting in on this marble fun. One of the marbles is rolling away. What did Autumn get? Is Autumn going to tell us what we got? Huh? Those what? marbles are loud. This is what we why don't you hold up on the marbles for a second there, Landon? I don't think it's Yeah, hold up on them for a minute so that they're not so loud. Well, I'm trying to find out what you got. Oh. Go She's got to go get it. Well, one of them's in my room. And what's Troy doing right now? Playing Red Redemption. He's playing Red Dead Redemption, the new game. Oh, and I already had Red Dead Redemption. Well, we already know that. We were asking what you got for Christmas. For Christmas, he got Red Dead Redemption. I already have Red Dead Well, Autumn got a Taekwondo Ninja shirt. She thinks she's a ninja. What else did you get over here? I'm a ninja. That's all of me. I'm a ninja. She thinks she's a ninja. I'm a ninja. Oh, I'm on. Trying to keep up with these children. And then she got a box. A box. A body spray. A box for me. And a perfume in there. Yep. So what, what kind of body spray did you get? Do I have to really name them all? Just show us. Bath and Body Works. Where did we get that from again? The dumpster. The dumpster. Dumpster score. Awesome. Awesome. And what else did you get? Okay, guys. A new set of whites. Your district champ whites. Some of you guys recall her washing her whites with green nail polish. She got a replacement set. That was her main gift, I guess you could call it. Yeah. She better not wash those with some green nail polish this time. Well, either way, those ones had to be replaced. There are three. They were three years old. Yeah, but they also got green spots on them. So that's what Autumn got, as well as one other gift. We'll have to go out to the garage and go see that. Want to go show the last gift? Yeah. Let's go. And the last gift that she got, thanks to Scrap and Pallet Man, that wonderful garbage find of a saddle right there. We got to go up to the barn and see that pony. Go try out that saddle. What do you want to say? What? You're going to say thanks to Scrap and Pallet Man for giving that Thank saddle you. to us? That saddle's awesome. But yeah, that was the last gift of Autumn's I from us was that <laughs> saddle that she cannot wait to use. And Rocky, enough. Okay. A loud shepherd. But that saddle is awesome. She can't wait to try it out. Thank you again, Scrap and Pal Man, for giving us that. That was an awesome part of the Christmas gift for Autumn. So, that's what the kids got for Christmas. They're all playing with the stuff, and they're all playing with the stuff. And so, it's kind of hard to really do much more than just show you what they got, because they are all intrigued with their new gifts. Hope you guys had a Merry Christmas with your families. Hey guys, so, I appreciate you guys stopping by and checking the video out. Um, whoo, you guys can't see me. There we go. But, I appreciate you guys stopping by and checking the video out. Um, you guys kind of saw everybody opening the presents earlier. 
I got off, I got home about 7.30, we opened presents off camera, kind of enjoyed ourselves, and then I went and took a nap, and I got up at 6, so, uh, that's kind of, that's kind of my day, the wife and kids are at the in-laws, and I'm not going there, but, but, uh, that was kind of our day, now, while they're over there enjoying themselves, I just woke up, and I'm gonna kind of sit around and edit some videos, get some stuff done that I need to get done, and... Uh, while I'm thinking about it, it's a wreck. I really haven't showed you guys the, uh, down my little studio since we wrapped it up, I don't think. I don't think I ever showed you guys, so I'll flip you guys around really quick. Alright, so, like I said, this is a wreck. But, there's a studio. So, we're going to eventually get a door here, and then we're going to put a table or shelves or something there. Eventually, I'm going to have a backdrop going across this wall. All my studio lights are going to be on this wall. This table, which eventually is going to get replaced with a hand-built table, is going to go right here. So we can do reviews and product stuff and things like that. Eventually, that table is going to get switched out for a U-desk. Uh, something that matches the trim. And then everything in the middle is going to be cleared. That green screen will probably stay for the live streams. That shelf is going to be there probably forever. And then there is a shelving unit inside that closet right there. But I'm not going to dig that out. But, oh yeah, calendar. You guys have probably seen it in quite a few videos, but uh, it's just something to help us try to get organized. But once I get this room actually like finished, finished, I get it cleaned up and organized and everything, I'm going to do a bigger video review, or reveal, not review, but uh, it's been a work in progress. I've spent a lot of time down here, a lot of money, and fixing stuff, repairing things, doing it again because it just didn't turn out right. But, I wanted to give you guys a quick glimpse. It's, like I said, extremely messy. We still got to work on the other side. We got to do the flooring, so I got to move everything over here. So, it's still messy, but it's getting there. But, like I said, I appreciate you guys stopping by, kind of hanging out, enjoying the video. It's over the last few days, a lot of it's just been me telling you about um, what time it is and what's going on. Just because I've been busy and... It's, it just sucks, but uh, hopefully you guys liked it. Hopefully it gives you an insight, at least to first responders and stuff, on how little time we get with our families. And, uh, you know, just makes you appreciated for, or appreciative of what you have. And for the people that actually don't get the time with their family, hopefully you guys appreciate what they do for you guys. But, uh, again, I appreciate you guys coming by, checking it out. Merry Christmas, you guys. I hope everyone had an amazing time. Hope you guys had a blessed, you know, Merry, uh, blessed Merry Christmas. And hopefully you guys got to spend some quality time with your family. We will catch you guys on the next one. Peace.